Islam has fallen. The eastern territories all but belong to the orcs. I'll have my men ready to depart by noon. Don't bother. But what of the mines? Without adamantite... The blight would have engulfed the mines ere long. Besides, you already have your orders. Yes, my liege. The dark swallows more of the realm with each passing day. The land starved of the ether that gives it life. And as the fringes fade, the people flock to the mother crystals, desperate for their blessing. The war we wage for possession of that blessing, it breaks us from within, hastening us to our own destruction. And so you do what must be done. I unite the dominance, that we may bring an end to the strife and found a new order to see us unto tomorrow. The world must be restored. And I will see it so. We might have already had Sidolphus not betrayed us. Him again. Lust you still for his embrace? But... Of course not. My liege. I serve you. And you alone. I remember well the day you first entered these halls. Your pale hand pressed into his, as if he would never let go. That... that was a long time ago. Yours is the only hand I need. Now? And always. Soon, my dear. Soon all will know whose hand it is that keeps them from falling into the darkness. Hold me, my leash. Never let me go. Sentries has failed to report, my lady. Your orders? Pull the men back inside the care, Geralt. He is here, then. Have them lead Sid and his little pet to the chapel. I shall entertain them there. Huh. So you've come for me after all. Teach me some time. We should start with the dungeons. They may be holding the bearers there. Sound plan. As long as we keep ourselves on this side of the bars. Gonna give up. Sid, this gate. Need some help.
know what happened here. A little late for prayer, isn't it? Do I seem so desperate as to grovel at the feet of a false god? <laughs> I was waiting for you. Not for too long, I hope. All this for a midnight chat. Well, let's chat then. Where are the men and women you took from Lost Wing? You mean where's the dominant? Well, Lude shall be requiring his services indefinitely. Come back to me, Sidothis. I need you. Think of all the things we can create together. The world that we can build. You need me. <laughs> Your king needs me. I'm all for building a new world. Just not his. That bastard's dreams are as twisted as his promises are false. And I want no part of them. King Barnabas saved you, and this is how you speak of him. Have you no shred of loyalty? What? To a leader who'd use me? Like he uses you. You know nothing of me, Sidolphus. You're right. I don't know who you are anymore. Or what you want. I only know what you used to say. That you were tired of running. That you just wanted to be free. Free of it all. You weren't lying to me then, so what changed? What made you think you had to sacrifice who you were to get what you wanted? Sacrifice? I use my talent to my advantage, and you would tell me there is shame in that? If there's no shame, then why do you feel so sorry for yourself? A rousing speech, Lord Commander. I was a fool to believe you might have changed. The only person I feel sorry for is you! I can't do this anymore. If you would stand between our leash and his dream, then you leave me no choice. Goodbye, Sidolphus. Stand back, Clive. Finish them. Well said. At least it's not three against one.
doesn't look happy, Toggle. Come on. Sid, are you all right? Do I look all right? <coughs> Benedicta will be on her way to collect the Dominant, if she hasn't already. You can't afford to let them leave. Remember, she has wings, you don't. What about you? Before or after I catch my breath. Sorry. <clears throat> Come on, Toggle. I confess I expected more from the old man. And less from you. This is the second time you've bested my sisters. Men of your talents are rare indeed. Why cost your lot with such undesirables? If it is the hearth you long for, you will find more than enough warmth under my wings. You know exactly what I want. Hand over the Dominant, and I'll leave you in peace. You would dare to make demands of me. Know your place, little lamb. Fool is the shepherd who heeds every bleat of the flock. And I will suffer yours no longer. <laughs> Must I spell it out for you, Branded? No one is listening. No one at all! Come, little lamb. To the slaughter with you. Where is he? I won't ask again.
Watch this. There's no one to save you now. to join your pet. Branded! I... I... How? How did you do it? How did you even survive? How? The answer is simple, Benedicta. He was fighting for something he believed in. Shut up! Why aren't you dead? We've played your games. Now tell me where he is. Are you?
of this. Give her back! Give her back! Give her back! My lady! Where is she? Where is Garuda? What have you done to me? What have you done? Look at me, my lady. We need you here. going on her power you, you you took it from her how'd you do that fuck me I hope the bear has found a way out This place is ready to collapse, and I'd rather not be here when it does. If your dominant started this fire, and I'm betting he did, he'll be long gone. Damn it all. Was that I created a diversion as commanded your grace the villagers escaped in the confusion as should we yes Come the cavalry, itching to butcher the bastards who made him miss their morning gruel. Come on, if they catch us leaving a burning care, people might jump to conclusions. Right. Oh, it's only me. Damn it, Gap. Are you trying to get yourself killed? It's not me who's been playing with fire. You don't do things by halves, do you? This way. So if it wasn't you or him who freed the bearers, who was it? Good question. Someone who didn't have their hands full fighting a bloody harpy, I guess. But what matters is they're safe. Something they wouldn't be had it not been for you, Gav. Ah, just doing my job, like. So, uh, what about his dominant? Gone. And after we were so close. Well, uh, I can track him. Why would you? Sid told us about your family. Lost me own to Imperial Steel. Sometimes vengeance is the only thing that keeps you going. Thank you. Go safely, brothers. <laughs> I reckon he likes you. Sh 
She's gone. She's gone. My lady, you have to hold on. I'm going to get you. Go, go, go. What am I going to do? The Barnabas. How long to the coastal road? At this pace, we won't make it by sunset. He'll know. He'll cast me out like all the others. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? My lady. <laughs> What do we have here? <laughs> Fetch a good price, I reckon. Who would be doing the slavers a disservice if we didn't appraise her worth? Stay away! <laughs> <laughs> It's all right. They can't hurt you anymore. Come on. Let's go home. Is this it, Sadolphus? My punishment for not listening to you? Did. Do you feel it too? Garuda. By the flames. She's drawn in too much ether. We can't control it. If Garuda isn't stopped, that vortex will swallow this whole forest, and us along with it. Then I'll stop her. You'll stop her. I heard it again. Someone is calling me. Damn it, lad. That doesn't mean you have to listen. Oh, I should have gone with Gab. I don't think you understand. That's not just windy weather you're wandering into. Benedict's rage knows no bounds. And that's on a good day. I don't want to know what's waiting inside that. But I do. I have to find out. And I'm not turning back. There are so many. Aye. One for every fragment of our mind. <laughs> <laughs> 